We are live! Wait. Wait. No, that's not right. Oh god, what's happened? Something awful's occurred. Hold up. Let me fix this. Uh, properties. Wait, holy fuck, when I... What happens if I... Oh, fuck. Well, that's obnoxious. How did I do it here? God, it changes all of them when I fucking do... <sighs> Alright, well, I'll have to fix that later. Anyway. It's nothing any... And nothing any you need to worry about. It's all backhand shit. Back again. Lisa Diedlier. Oh, God. Uh, <sighs> whoops, wrong button. No, no, no. Give me the map. Uh, we can hit a, we can hit a merchant. Probably don't need to double merchant. Uh, elite fire elite is pretty rough. I can also go this way. Yeah, I probably don't need a merchant that early, and then I can decide between fire and elite. Hit two more question marks. And where do I go from there? That way, I can still hit one merchant. Oh, this has got two fires. Yeah, no matter what, I have to run into an elite. Well, I'll figure that out when I get here. Yeah, I think I actually want to start, like, down here. So, the extra money is, like, whatever. Although, the extra hundred gold here, plus whatever gold I get on the way to, like, this first... That might matter, because like 100 gold gets me... I already have enough for the first card removal, 100 gold gets me enough for the second. But I could also use it for something else if I have enough money by then, because that's over... Uh, you know, I could have 300 gold by then. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think that's a good one. I think I want the 100 gold. Uh, yeah. Let's just start down here. Okay, okay. Just a big, uh, a big wiener man. That's fine. Um, I will take the ten, just because I can heal six, so it's like, not that biggie a dizzle. Mm, well. He's gonna block, so I can just, oh. Block again, eh? I forgot we were in fast mode. This is, well, it's faster. Hold up. There we go. Uh, can I do 16? Yes, I can. Alright, so he's, he's dead. Cool. Battle Trance has basically always been good. Getting that this early? Having, like, a legit good... F Ooh. Uh, 16? Okay. So you're only dealing 6, so if I just kill you... So long as I take no more damage, which shouldn't be too hard against these guys. Uh, sure, Battle Trance, may as well. Can I kill him? That's... how much is that? That's 17, 8 plus... that'll be 9. Yeah, I can just kill him. Don't even need to defend. Uh... If you get, like, a lot of cards on cycle, like, we do have the battle, the battle trance. Wait, whoops. I, I think we can... I really need to upgrade Anger, though, if we're actually gonna use it. We got a little while to our first merchant, however... Like... That's if we go down the left path. Eh, we, we could have other chances to remove cards. I mean, that means that that means we're not gonna get to remove the other stuff. I think this is probably better. Ah, or Chalcum. Okay, okay. Especially at this point, that's not bad. Transform a card. Transform that. Oh. Well, that, that doesn't really help much. Um, well, I got an attack. Yeah, so transform this. Fuck! Well, I didn't really want that. Hey! Ooh, a pendib too. Um... I think we can take an elite. There's nothing that I like really, 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 really want to upgrade? Upgrading the anger would be pretty strong. 
but getting a random relic, again, you want to take our risks early. Um, maybe I shouldn't have done that, but I wanted the bash. And then yeah, just wait for it and then go ape shit. Assuming I draw at least three strikes. Hmm, that's annoying. Oh. Oh yeah, I guess it's still- fuck. Well, that doesn't really work. At all, does it? Well, that plan didn't fucking work. Alright, whatever, just fucking hit him. Had it on the first time, he would have been down 9 extra health. Oh well. So defend a strike or a battle trance. Just fucking do it. Well, that's gone now. Oh shit, he's hitting me. He's hitting me real damn hard. Well, not much I can do about that here. God, I forgot how hard these assholes are. Uh, it's like I gotta kill him because he makes me so fucking weak. So fucking fast that it's just like, I think I gotta just take this 20. Oh yeah, I shouldn't have done that one block anyway. Okay, so he's gonna do his debuff. Uh, Havoc and Anger kind of work well together. Uh, cool, I'll take it. Especially like once, you know, it like burns through all my strikes and shit like that. Um, hold up, can I kill him? I don't think I can kill him. Um, I actually get more or- yeah, because this is only giving me four block now, whereas that always gives me six. So long as I don't already have block, so... Jesus Christmas. Fuck. Well, this is gonna hurt. That's fine, he's dead. Oh, he's not dead. Well, he is still dead. Curse cards cannot be played. Playing a curse will make you lose 1 HP and exhausts the card. Well, that's actually kind of handy. Yeah, I'll take the ghostly armor. Wow, we got the shit kicked out of us. Trigger a trap. Uh, become cursed. I can do that. Take 20 damage. Yeah, we'll just become cursed. This might be a curse run. I think I, I think I definitely need to hit that. Well, yeah, let's see. Let's just see. Regular fight. Cool. Whatever. I can play this. Yeah. Considering it does more damage. Oh. Well, I'm not gonna not play it. Considering it does more damage if I leave it in my hand. Uh, I think I'll just play this. Get rid of injury. Battle Trance, Ghostly Armor, Bash, Anger, keep rolling. Anger and Havoc like can kind of work together, alright he's dead. I healed up, seeing red is pretty good with all the card draw we have. I think I have to go left. I want to see if the merchant has the Duvu doll, because if he does, then we rock in. Here's max HP by 7. Sure, fine, whatever. Um, I might want to nap? I only have one more chance to nap, and I have to do at least two regular fights and an elite. However, last run was a bit of a curse run, ended up with three curses and Duvu doll. How much does, how much strength does Duvu doll give you per curse? Three? Like, a pretty good amount, if I recall. What does this do? Upgraded. Cost zero. That's really good. You only get to use it once. Which is the downside. Yeah, I can't. I can't do two fights and then an elite. And then a boss fight, with only one rest in between. Well, then again, the boss doesn't hit. Oh, it only gives you one? I thought it gave you more than that. Okay. Huh, interesting. Shop Spear 50% more often, just 20% discount. Fuck. 
Fucking go big or go home. Alright, we're after curses now, I guess. Duvidal would be pretty handy. Would have liked to get that earlier, but if we get like the key or something, one of the other items that gives us three curses, that's not bad. Um. Okay, well, I would really like to. Oh shit, no, he's gonna pop himself. Right, I should have hit him. I'm an idiot. Because <sighs> we can't get rid of him now. It's one to one. That sucks. Uh, okay. One of these. And then I kind of just have to hit him. Get this out of my deck. Um. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that kind of works. Fucking let's fly in here. Okay, so he's gonna make me vulnerable, but that's fine because he's buffing. Yeah. I guess we'll get the pen nib on that, that's fine. It's better than nothing. I do have just a single fucking fruit fly in here. Jesus, hold up. Can I kill him? Maybe. Cool. This makes me play curses, but not statuses. That's a status. There are other cards that work with curses and statuses. Should I try to make that deck? We're going for it. We're trying it out. Seeing how this shit goes down. Whew! Fuck, 13 damage again. No card draw here. Need a bit more card draw. For sure. No point in playing with seeing red. Okay, well. Oh, it takes seven plus the one, so eight, which is pretty bad. Hold up, I think he's dead. Yeah. Spot weakness is pretty good. I don't know if it fits with our style, though. We're drawing a lot of cards and don't have a lot of extra mana. If you don't get evolved, this is all bad. Probably. Okay, good. This man. Um, I will play that now. Uh... I want to use one of the... nope. If only I could draw some cards. Might not have even been worth playing. Wait, why do I have two strength? Oh, right, right, because the power. Da 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 da. <sighs> Just drink the thing, make it worth it, maybe, probably. Or Chalcon gives me six for free. I keep forgetting about that damn thing. Uh, this is gonna make him go apeshit rage mode. Hold up. Let's just try to kill him really fast. How many zero costs? Not enough. Yeah, just use your Chalcum. Yikes. Fucking mega yikes. I think I'm actually gonna just double defend here. Eh, should've played the red. Whoops. Try to kill him. There we go. Okay. Got the Dex Potion back. Yeah. Sure. Go to sleep. Have a nap. Alright. <clears throat> Let's see what we get. Now we just gotta hope to get, like, good shit. Cards and relic-wise. From the Hexa Ghost. Well, that's gone. Going on to use explosive probably during this. You just don't ever want to play defense against him unless you can kill next turn. I don't know. Uh, well, especially with the Orch Alchem, I probably shouldn't have, but it's, it's too late now. Let's play this because it's a bigger, longer thing. I should have just played it. What am I doing? I'm a fucking idiot. Uh, yeah, block.
Well, yeah, I'll do this. I only missed out on two block this turn, I guess. Or no, that's two decks. Fuck, I missed out on four block. That sucks. Okay, well, Orchalcum already gives me enough to block that, so I don't actually need to block here. Uh, yeah, actually. Play the Wild Strike. Fuck! Should've been paying attention to Pendib. Rip. Minute delay, yeah. Uh, that's a status, right? Not a curse? Sick. Well... Cool. I guess I should've still played the- yeah, I'm an idiot. Yeah, I got nothing else, can't draw any cards, so... Whatevs. Or... Okay, he's just buffing, so... Go... Ape... Shit. Alright! <sighs> Kinda holding in there. Plus two strength, great, great, great. That's 14 damage. I need to draw cards really badly. There's no good reason not to use this. Okay. Pray. I. Just use it because I got the mana and fuck it. Oh, did I recycle through Pendib already again? Of course, now this turn. Now this turn, it's like, fuck. I think I have to try to block as much as I can here. Because that's a lot of fucking damage. Yeah. Okay, 8 damage. talking about this yesterday and I was like, uh... Oh, hey, Notorious Crab. Yeah, 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 it's like a, like a deck-building roguelike that I'm not great at. We're on Ascension 3, so like there's the default mode, and once you either beat all three Axe 3 bosses or beat the game five times, you unlock Ascension. And to unlock further levels of Ascension, you have to beat the previous level, and each adds an additional difficulty modifier, and like, they're all cumulative. So right now, elite monsters appear more often, normal enemies, hit harder, and elite enemies hit harder. Luckily bosses, which this is, uh, don't have any modifiers on them, so, so the bosses are still the same. Oh, a burn plus. In my hand? It's more likely than you'd think. I think I might die? I think I might die. I think... Nope, I'm still alive. Just barely. Well, pen nib and anger. Yeah, these angers have, uh, killed me. Well, I'm still not dead. Oh, wait. Yes, I am. Desecrated? Every time it's, like, a bit different. It's, like, conquered, desecrated. I guess it depends on what, uh... Oh, have I got no more unlocks? And also the ascension levels are different for, uh, each of the two characters. I've hit my head against ascension level 3, although I keep making, like, bad choices and just trying to see how they go. Can a random common relic. Boom. Huh. Alright. Ooh. That's a good path. That's also a pretty good path. So this is fire, and then I can either go into elite, or fire fire elite. I like that. Yeah, I like that path very much. All, all left. As we, we heal up. Six at each combat, so losing 50 HP. We can manage, so he's buffing, so I wanna smash him. What is that, that's 19? I can't actually get through 19 damage in one turn. So since neither one of them's attacking, I'll just do it like this. And then I can kill him next turn, probably. Assuming, yeah. And, whoop! I just pulled the card off the top of my deck and played it. Well, whatever. I actually kind of want- Turns out it was a card I wanted to play, so... 
Uh, double strike. Oh, oh, he actually weakened me and I didn't notice. That was almost a mistake. I don't vote elites unless your deck is great. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, hmm, Pommel Strike gets really good once it's upgraded. We're already really low on health, so Berserk's not a bad option. Fucking Berserk goes better if you can increase your max hand size. Pommel Strike is just generally good. I think I'm gonna grab Berserk though. Transform a card, upgrade a card. Berserk is not really an attack, per se. Whoops, whoops, whoops. I think I want to remove. Let's get rid of the strike. Okay, so this is the last hole. Can't kill him yet. Fuck. I have to take some damage here. Rip. No dex potion, nothing. Okay, well. Four damage, it's like, uh you're at half health, elites will always do at least 20 damage to you. That's true. I won't be saying a lot about this game, I know next to nothing, but the gameplay is entertaining. Well, I'm glad you like it. Okay, they're both doing their confusing bullshit. So, we'll make him... Alright, yeah. Vulnerable makes him weak as well. Because of the champion belt. Alright, he's attacking again and he's still weak, and I can't spend all this mana on hits anyway, so fuck him. Yeah. So, I wanna try to get stuff that makes dude's vulnerable because that also makes them weak which means they deal less damage so it's like offense and defense flex is like just generally pretty good this fucking fly is pissing me off yeah we'll take flex no I'll just gain the hundred no I don't need the money yet. If I go this way, I skip two fires and half- Well, I don't have to fight an elite. There's no merchant on this path, I just noticed. Rip. I think I go the left path just for the extra... What do I want to upgrade? Upgrade or defend. And go fight the regular man. Okay, Big Birdo. That's fine. Start wailing on him. I need something cheap that gives vulnerability. Huh. Oh, defend plus. And then I guess I flex. I berserk. I whack him. Seems to work out pretty well. He gets stronger. Uh, he is no longer vulnerable, so I can't kill him this turn. If I get three strikes next turn, I can kill him. Or... a flex. And a bash. And a strike. That'll work, too. I don't really have the deck to make barricade work. Headbutt. Okay, I think now I want to nap, probably. Yeah, let's let's do one nap. Hey! Should have taken that curse. Should have got that extra money. Alright. Reach curse. Start the combat with one additional strength. Uh, I think I want to upgrade the flex here. The best probably AoE, vulnerable, weak, and four damage. Yeah, that's pretty good. I think I want to upgrade the flex. Okay, so now we can get a little something out of having curses in our deck. Um, if I hit him twice, he'll wake up. So I think I just wait. Because he wakes up on his own after three turns. Fuck, I can't use all this fucking... I could get Bash and a bunch of defense, though. I think I just busted this turn. Put the flex back up. Hit him that strike. He's still not gonna do anything on his turn. Wouldn't have gotten the doll if you took the curse though. RNG would have screwed you. No, I'm pretty sure the seed is actually set as soon as you start the run. And I don't think it changes as it goes. I'm pretty sure it would have been exactly the same. 
because there's they did an update that you can like set your seed to something so that you can do the same run over and over again or try different people's runs and shit like that something like that huh wow that's uh that's a lot of damage well oh hey i have a block potion remember those potions uh, headbutt, the defend plus, and then, I gotta kill him quick though, cause he makes me, like, weaker and weaker and weaker as the fight goes on, so, I'll take that, and frown, but, okay, now, I should be paying attention, he, he does what, attack, attack, debuff, like, is that his pattern? Fuh. Okay, so his next one should be- Oh, right! Ah, I weakened him because of the vulnerable. Seems for sure set, but you had no way of knowing anyway. That's true. Uh, so he should be dead now. First time you lose eight HP each combat, draw three cards. I don't want anger. No. No. Okay, so we got some amount of card draw. I need some, like, energy... stuff. Uh, okay, so I should attack the one that's buffing. Headbutt the flex back, hit him, gain the block. Attack, attack, debuff, repeat. Yeah. Okay, so there's the extra cards from the Centennial Puzzle. So he's dead. Get that flex up. Hit him. Smash him. Good, good. Can I do 13 damage? Yes, I can. Okay. Rage has been good every time I've taken it, but I haven't taken it every time I've seen it. Right now there's two. This game is still in early access, as you see up there. So there's a third one in development. And the, the two that there currently are like have very, very different decks. Uh, like, besides the strikes and the basic- the basic strikes and defense, all the other cards available to them are unique. Um, what, what am I looking at? Oh, right, right, right. Rage. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. It costs zero. I, uh, I, I think I just have to take Rage. I already upgraded one of my defense, didn't I? No explosive potion, that was the other run. Rip. Uh... Fuck. This sucks. Alright, well... Oh, hey, I can still use this. Sweet. Alright, well, we're still... Taking some damage. But... Yeesh. What a fucking hand. What do I have? Four strength? Yeah. Likely to be a mage type. Well, have you seen? They've actually shown off a, uh, like a silhouette of it, and it looks like some weird golem thing. I don't expect it to be mage type. Especially since, as other people have pointed out, like, making, making strength and, like, weakened, uh, doesn't make sense if your basic attacks are not like strikes where you're actually using your physical prowess to hit stuff whereas in, in for both of the classes currently that's the case um what am i doing i can kill one can i kill two no i can kill one i got a defend plus what do i want to put up top probably that defend plus yeah Okay, two more damage. I think that means we've taken three damage, more than we're gonna heal, which is not great. Uh, speaking of not great, this hand. Oh, may as well get the three free block. Bash this man. Oh, right, right, right. Weakens him, too. I, I keep forgetting about that. I keep forgetting the champion, though. The champ. Okay, well, I can kill off these assholes. 
Um, at this point, let's get Rage back, I guess. Okay, not too bad. Basically lost 3 HP, which, considering how low we were, is like... Hmm... Oh wait, if it flex, then yeah, it'll just kill him in two hits. Right. Fire potion, that's nice. Nope. With Rage, if I get rid of... Because I've done a really good Clash deck, too. Who knows? Who knows how I died? I'm gonna take the Clash. Oh, fuck. These assholes. So what is this? Every time they take damage. Attack damage. So I want to kill them, like, ASAP. I'm gonna need the, uh, I'm gonna need Flex in my hand to do that. This guy just, like, buffs other people with his block. Okay. Well, we're gonna kill you first, since you're the one doing the most damage. <sighs> A little bit of damage. I can fire potion one of these assholes right now. Goodbye. I should have done that turn one. And now he's full of block, which is annoying. Defend plus. Okay, we should have this. Flex. Cool. No. Still need a good source of card draw. Can I fight him with 55 health? I think I can. I have a less crap deck. Yeah. Um, I want to upgrade Rage. We need to be able to- we need to get rid of a lot of our cards, though. Uh, yeah, Flex. I guess Raging here doesn't do anything for me, so... Just smash him. Okay, first things first. Get weakened! What can I grab? I can grab Rage or Flex. Fuck, I don't remember what all those different things are. He's gonna put debuffs on me. I probably don't need the rage quite yet. Hold up. What is that? 8, 13, 18? That's how much damage he's doing. So I can actually just block all of it and be fine. Okay. Yeah, only 4 damage. Mmm. I got no card draw. I got no block. Well, looks like I'm taking four. Can't play the clash. Rip. Ayo! Mm, and the burn. Sick. Okay, so he's doing six. Fuck, that's a lot of blocks. Okay, well, I can double strike gain. Oh, I just upgraded it right. And then we'll berserk for now, because at the very least, it takes it out of our deck. Fine by me. Four damage. Fuck, no block again. It's like one or the other. Either all block or no block. Okay, let's add another weak to him. Just because making him weak is pretty fucking handy. Get another flex going. Although I think he might actually do a big hit soon. Or no, it's. it's ba he has a specific thing he does at like each fire lit up. He has like a six turn cycle. It's once all six are lit up that he does the big, big attack. Um, well, once I get rid of Flex, I can use Clash. Put that on, keep him weak, hit him, hit him. So then he blocks and buffs. Annoying. I think it's X times six, weak plus burns, and flame, regular weak attack, something else repeat. Well, it's, it was like, attack, attack, something buff, I don't know. I already lost track. 
Rage and one attack and a bunch of defense. Ugh, where have I seen this before? Please tell me where. Well, I may as well play because at this point an attack is just as good as a regular defend. Um. I'm flex. I'm just fucking play all the shit, I guess. I should have grabbed the rage back, probably. Yikes. Well, I'm gonna lose half of that to the fucking burns. Yep. There's the big one. Hmm. No block stuff. And he's not weakened. This is gonna suck. Man, my fucking card draws have been... Wait, what did I just play? Fuck, I just played... Wait, why is this seeing red in my... Oh. Wait, what did I just... Oh, it was flex. Uh, why do I have an extra energy? Why do I have four energy? Why do I have four energy? Ah! Under half health. I'm an idiot. God, I can't believe that took so long to fucking for my brain to figure the fuck out. Okay, well... Since our deck is being a total fucking disaster. It's really mostly my fault. Well, we're almost dead. Leave it to you after he hit you for 35 damage. Yeah. I figured it out, but Twitch delay. Can't play the Clash because of the fucking burn. Cool. <sighs> Please. Well. GG, fellas. G. Oh. He was vulnerable. I won. I think I really need the card draw right now. Do it to it. Yep. Ah, <sighs> blood vials good. Meh. Maybe. Alright, uh, yeah, we're risking it for the biscuit. Our deck is just not fit for this sort of bullshit. We do get to start with three strength. Drawing extra cards, losing extra HP. Gaining extra HP. Losing even more HP. That gets rid of itself. Luckily. Yeah, we need cards that do things. I got like a bunch of different buffs, but it's like I need something to do with those buffs. And that I do not have. Okay, I kind of like that path. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, this asshole! I haven't seen this guy in a while! Oh, right, that's a power. I gotta play that. Hmm, I don't know, Chris is gonna be pretty bad. Well. Seeing red plus clash is a pretty bad combination, I've come to realize. This is about to suck. Oh, I get to draw extra cards. Good. Pain. Perfect. Higher chance of getting rage. Wait, why did I take a damage? Hold up. Did I take a damage when I played that? I gotta deal 14 damage in one go. When other cards are played, that would do it. Yeah, I had blue candle last time, but it's like, fuck. Fuck. 
I don't know, man. This seems pretty rough. Drawing into the pain is not... Not cool. I think I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna just be killing myself here. What did I just put back on top? Oh, the bash, duh. Jesus, Jesus, okay. So now we flex. No, get out there. Now we seeing red. Now we bash. Defend. Strike. Kill. Good. <sighs> and apply one vulnerable. Yeah. That one damage per card is killing you faster than the monsters. Yeah, it really is. Alright. Chalcum, no. Yeah, I don't like any of these options. Get rid of the regular block. Limit break. I start with three strength. Going for it. Now I need to upgrade that, like, ASAP. Yep, yep. Goodbye, Blood Vial. Hello, Bite Town. Hey! Yeah, I'll take that. Cleric, you are kind soul receiver purification! It's a weird looking cleric. Do I need that many bites? I don't have any other block cards. Maybe I should not remove that many. I think I actually need to get rid of one of these bites. I probably need to get rid of two of these bites, but... Okay, okay, okay. Bloodletting. More energy generation. I do have the healing now. I'm gonna get bloodletting. What does bloodletting do upgraded? Gonna get bloodletting. So that's clumsy. Fuck! God damn it. Every time. That's the only time. Both times that I've ever had a second fucking bash in my deck, it was from that goddamn game. Um, I guess with the, the belt it's not that bad, especially now that I've got some decent mana generation, maybe? I got extra card draw. And I've got health gain. Ah. Bites are good, but it's like, I need... I only have three cards that block in one rage, and like, all this shit, like I... I can't have my deck be this many non-block cards. Bloodletting. How do I mean? Bloodletting doesn't really draw me cards. The first time in a battle, I lose HP. I draw three. None of these else. Yeah. Damn it! For some, for for, I was like, wait, wait, have I gotten anything good out of my frozen egg? And it's like, shit, skill, skill. The answer is no, I have not gotten anything good out of my frozen egg. Uh, I guess we just gotta do this guy. Uh, okay. I can handle this. I mean, I may I may as well play it now, since my, I have nothing else to gain strength. So, sure, six strength. Top of the fight. I'm probably gonna go under half health. So... Oh. Hmm, this changes things a little bit. Jesus, 17 damage. Um... Yeah... Well, oh, this also applies weak, though. Hold up. So that's, what, 25% less damage? 
So it will be doing 15 instead of 18. That's only 3. No, it's not really worth it. Now we berserk. Then we kill this little man. And then we nom this man. I think that might be the only way to get bash. Um, yeah, actually, now that I think about it. Yeah, bloodletting... It can draw me cards, that assumes, like, I know... My, my fucking curses will give me the card draw. Like, bloodletting doesn't really draw me cards, because I'm going to draw those cards no matter what. This draws me cards. God, I really need to upgrade the seeing red. Uh, okay, so he's gonna do the buff and defend. You know what, Thunderclap again is not a bad one. And then, there's no point to that. Don't ever give up! I don't know why he's... Oh, the weakness wore off. Uh, I've got news... a news flash. No, it fucking didn't. Um... Hmm... Heal the HP... And kill him faster, because he's going to keep buffing himself, too. That hurt. Alright, well now we're getting extra energy. We got extra card draw. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Can't play that clash. No siree. Okay, so he's just going to summon dudes. Oh, my favorite dudes. So they'll gain strength, but they'll also become weak. Mm. They're vulnerable. Yeah, he'll get them all back when he rallies again. But... Hold up, do I even need... Nope. Uh, Rage would be not bad. And then... Fuck, now I've got too much energy. 14 times 3, huh? Have you actually buffed that many fucking times? Holy shit. When the fuck did he hit 8 strength? Christ. Ayo. Uh, should be able to kill him, maybe? I don't know. Math will figure it out. And then, bad. Yeah, he's dead. Front scale's not bad. <sighs> Let's have a nap. Hold up. Okay, so I'm gonna start with, like, a shitload of extra energy on that fight, since I'm doing... To ooh, ooh, yeah. So you start at three. I'm gonna have four, five, six, seven energy for this fight. I think. Okay, okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. Do I want to nap again? I need to. I need to start upgrading stuff. Mmm, innate, I see. I was like, what the fuck's the difference? Do the limit break. Only six. Three. What? It doesn't count them both? Bullshit. Hey, a limit break. I'll take that. Oh, because of the pain. I was like, why the fuck? This sucks. I have, like, not even enough shit to draw to play all this shit. So they take half? Hmm. 
Well, whatever. Oh, yeah. Stop you from doing whatever bullshit you're about to do. Do I need the brutality? I don't think so. Okay, so he's buffed, he's stunned, he hits me a bit. It's fine. Hmm. I kind of wish I had that extra fucking card now, but... Oh shit, I didn't even realize he was doing 3 damage. Oh right! Bronze scales! Bronze scales makes them eat shit. Um... Yeah, how about no? Fuck. Well... Six damage! There's the Berserk. Well, whatever. Oh, he's actually... No, he's dead. He's dead. Regen potion is handy. Where? Inadvertently. Going strength build. Once again, it seems. So I heal 25. Can I fight this elite with 36 health? I could skip this elite. So do I want a random relic or do I want to up... No, there are too many cards I need to upgrade. Like Heavy Blade. Heavy Blade. Heavy Blade. And Bloodletting, and Seeing Red, and Bites, and Defense, and Berserk. Well, looks like Heavy Blades are- I should just try for a Strength Build every time. No, that's not true, I've gotten some outstanding block rates. Huh. 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 Oh, right. <laughs> Uh, rage. Fucking drink this potion, please. Last time I didn't play that, I regretted it. I think I want to kill this guy first. Taking a lot of damage. Because this guy just like hit. Oh, he does buff himself, looks like. Okay, uh, do I want a seeing red? Hit five. One, two, three, four. I don't actually need it. So we limit break first. 12 strength. I can't actually kill him. Shit. Oh, the weakness helps. Okay. Still pretty fucking low. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. And then I killed him. I need another good block card. 18 health on Elite, I am gonna say no. Fuck! This is a regular fight? I thought this was like a fucking Elite fight. This is a regular- Oh, maybe this is an Elite fight, because this is a- Was this a question mark? No. Shitty titters. Fuck. Well. Uh, this sucks a whole hell of a lot. Chomp him, gain the health. One shot card. Yeah, Heavy Blade, once you've got some strength, does outrageous damage, because it gains... Because six strength means all my attacks do six times... Or, six extra damage, so this normally does eight. Heavy Blade gets affected by strength... Well, upgraded Heavy Blade gets affected by strength five times, so instead of gaining six extra damage from my six strength there, it is gaining 30 extra damage. Since I got a card that every time I play it, my strength doubles... It's, uh, pretty fucking nuts. It's like, why can't I have fucking Seeing Red on this turn? I could actually use it here. Uh, well, the Heavy Blade kills him. And then I think I play Berserk. Goodbye. Yeah, starting with three strength and being able to double it right away is actually kind of handy. 
It's a regular one? Oh, this fight? Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, I guess it is. I'll take their word for it. I have nothing else to spend the mana on, so... Oh, right. Flex it out. Need some of that health back. Give me a little headbutt. Uh, take the heavy blade, because that'll kill him. So elite, though boss fights, that's your win con. Well, I mean, I heal 25 at the start of boss combat, so even though... So I can get back to pretty close to full health. Um, right. Die. <sighs> nope. Skip it. Because... I'll give me 24, plus 25, so 49. Yeah, that'll get me pretty close to full... Wait, what are we fighting? Uh... Is that the dude on the skull? Either way, I don't trust 22 HP to get me there. Still so many cards to smith. I'm not sure I can afford to, like, lose half my HP at the start of runs anymore. Just because it means I have to spend more fire... Like, I'll survive them, but I have to spend more fire places sleeping instead of upgrading. Yeah, it is the dude on the skull. Okay. Uh, so here's a trick. So this limit break doubles your strength. Flex, gain four strength at the end of your turn, lose four strength. So the way that works is I go up to seven strength, double it, go up to 14, and then lose four, putting me at 10. Uh, well, he's not doing anything this turn. So we get a big um buff him. Yeah, I have nothing to do with all this fucking energy on turn one. Yeah, 23 damage from headbutt, which normally does nine. Uh, I'm gonna put Limit Break back on top. Thank you very much. And just pass, I guess. Cause... Hot damn. I'm gonna... I've had, I've had, like, heavy blades that dealt, like, 400 damage before. Fucking Christ on a cob. Oh, they're hitting me kinda hard back there. Get rid of this and I can play the Clash. I'm gonna try to kill one of them. Oh. Um, at 34 damage, I feel like this should go... Although, prevent 7, although... Mm, nah. At 34 damage, I think I should hit that guy with it. Well, maybe I should... Should have used the, uh, the Bash. Uh, yeah, since we're gonna heal... And inflame. Even more strength. Heavy Blade, 129 damage, you say? Hold up. Gain that extra so that I can make everyone vulnerable first. Oh, I should have used the Seeing Red instead. 129 plus vulnerable, I think, wins the fight. Yep. And that's Heavy Blade in a strength build. If I get it opening hand, that's insane, because... But that's a big if. No, I think I have to skip all of these. Curse key it is. Yeah. Strength builds where you've got, like... Because all you need for a strength build is, like, Heavy Blade, some source of strength, and Limit Break. And it's like, there you go. You don't even need Limit Break, necessarily, if you've got... There are other cards that can perpetually gain you strength, but, like, Demon Form gives me two strength every turn. There's a Spot Weakness, where if an enemy is intending to attack you, you can play Spot Weakness, targeting them, and you gain three strength. It costs one to do that, though. Um, yeah... Wait, what am I looking at? What am I looking at? Maybe you open a non-boss chest, obtain a curse, which increases our strength, which means our double strength gets outrageous even faster. I think this is the first run tonight where we've actually made it to Act- Oh, fuck, this is Act 3! Act 1 must have just wiped itself from my mind. Okay, well, we need that shop. In fact, we probably need both of those shops. I can get a fire. 
We might even be able to use all three of those shops. Well, fuck it. Cause we got all, we got a fair amount of money. Twenty nine damage on on oh fuck, man these guys are hitting hard. Hold up, can I like? Okay, good. <laughs> Prevented his damage. First I was like, you're getting pooped on, and now I'm like. Yeah, I mean, things can turn around really fast, depending. I guess I'll hit this guy, because I can't really hit him next turn. So these guys, they don't die until you kill all three of them. And if you go a turn, uh, like after a turn, this guy will regenerate, so I have to kill all three of them within two turns of each other. Which is slightly annoying. No rage. Where's- oh, right. I was like, where am I getting the fourth energy? Because of Cursed Key. It's an upside with an extra upside because of Doohoo Doll. Um, I think we have to limit break. Yeah, this clash is useless with these curses in my deck. Vulnerability also gives weakness. So if I do that, I probably shouldn't have done that. Those are nasty? Yeah. Nah. Play it safe, take the block. I do have extra energy now, so sure. But it's like you get them all around to half health like this and it's not too bad. Yeah, I have more energy than I know what to do with. 13 damage, 2 HP. I'll hit you, because why not? Okay, and he's dealing 18 damage, which sucks. Uh, okay, so we rage. We flex. We inflame. We limit break. We berserk. Hold up. We're seeing red. We thunderclap. Make them all vulnerable, make them all weak. You're doing the most damage, so I think I have to bite you. And we eat. I might be able to kill the both of them. Yep. Actually, use two bites, gain more HP that way. Dex potion, second heavy blade. My deck's pretty fucking big. The card draw's not great. But I I think I need the block more. You there, what you got? Yeah, shut up. Uh what is nope. Does that also apply weak then on the first turn? The end of combat Ooh. I could get both. Meat on the bone's pretty good for the way I'm running. Especially since I have a lot of cards that hurt myself. Fuck, I have so many fucking cards. Um, is Rage actually good for me here? I just got two more block cards. I think I may might get rid of that other bash, though. Instead of a bite. Yeah. Oop. Oh, clicked out of the screen. There we go. Get rid of the bash. Buy the meat on the bone. 56 strength plus thunderclap. Bag? What bag? Oh, I see. I mean, that's, that's alright. I still probably wouldn't have grabbed it over the meat. Oh fuck, I was gonna go to that other merchant, wasn't I? Well, shit. Could've removed two. 
Rip. I think I can take this fight. It's the guy at the back who gains three strength every turn. These guys are just assholes. Okay, so rage first. Took it off. Thunderclap's not bad. Although, one, two, three, four, yeah, I may as well do it this way. Bite him. Berserko. Let's go, Berzoingo. Hmm, that's annoying. That's also annoying. Additional annoyment. Fuck. Hey. Look what I found. Hmm. Well, I still block all the damage, but he keeps getting stronger real fast, but I also keep getting stronger. Hmm. Excuse me. I think these both go away? Yeah. Yeah, it's the lack of consistency. I have too many cards that I have to, like, dig a while to get all my powers and shit up. Why is this in flame upgraded? Did I get it after I got Frozen Egg? Maybe. I don't remember upgrading in Flame. Hmm. Weird. Welp. I think I'm gonna have to do it like this. Oh, 22 damage. No biggie. Yeah, all these guys do is keep trashing, putting garbage in your deck like that. Okay, so I should be able to kill him. Good. Very good. Ah, uh, fuck. I should have played Heavy Blade and then that. Uh, Limit Break. Why not? Because, yeah. Oh, well. I could have won guaranteed next turn. Not that it super matters. Because I, I don't think this guy attacks. I think that's all he does. I'm not gonna use Bloodletting. There's no way to heal him, so I want to try to kill him. Fuck, I'm losing one HP per turn because of the, uh... That one, the skill I played. Woo! One HP a turn! I'm waiting for some bites to kill this man with! Are you fucking joking me? I'm actually... <laughs> Holy fuck. Oh, you- Oh shit, he actually attacked me! Um... Fuck off. <gasps> oh hey, we can go to that merchant now. Yeah, I need another heavy blade. That meat was kinda handy, that extra 12 HP we just got. And, uh, I got an old coin as the relic. Um, shit. Oh, I can get extra HP. What do I need? This plate and headbutt for the health. Yeah, this is uh, pretty rough. Pretty fucking rough. So he's hitting me again. 33, that's not enough. Hold up. What happens if I do this? 55, that's not enough. Hold up. What happens if I do this? Now you're dead. God, I need it to offer me some decent upgraded cards. Oh, maybe the inflame I picked was already upgraded? I don't know. Because it's like, I would take an upgraded Pommel Strike. <laughs> More into- they can, they can. Nine damage drop card is pretty good, especially when I have a shitload of strength. It's like, I need to- I need to take Clash out of the deck. That's the number one card that's gotta go. Honestly, like, I could get rid of- I could handle get rid of, getting rid of, like, these two curses and just keeping this one since it gets rid of itself. Just for the one strength at the start. Cause then once- once you have that, you just limit break, limit break, limit break, limit break. But the last time I did this, I had a much smaller deck, so I was seeing limit break way more often. The prod ones? What oh, prod ones? Anyway, I think I'll skip it. Back to the Moichin. Oh. Hmm. 
Hmm. Hold up. Are there any more merchants on my path? Potentially. Hold up. How do I want to go? I definitely want to go there. And I definitely want to go there. And then, like, bing, bang, boom. That way's a guaranteed elite, but also a guaranteed bonfire. If I go around this way, I don't have to fight an elite. And it's just... Yeah, yeah. I don't think I need any more relics at this point. I think I need health and upgrades. So, like... Hit there, go here. I'm gonna get a curse from here. Okay. So the next card removal is gonna cost 150. Okay, get rid of Clash. <sighs> I don't have the card draw for one extra energy every three turns to be really, really good. At this point, I think maybe getting rid of a bite. Upgrading a, de a defend, too, since rage isn't doing a whole heck of a lot for me. I mean, it sometimes is, but it's like... Or no, no, don't upgrade the defense, upgrade the shrug it offs. Yep. 30 health! Dexterity potions. Pretty. Prodigy X, he's the first pirate legend from Sea of Thieves. 13k people in his chat one night? Holy fuck. Dark Souls is like, eh, I can repeat in two seconds. Yeah, I mean, it depends. Two. Two of them. Huh. That's a... Sloit problem. Should've used the Dex potions. I'm an idiot. Uh, hit the one with slightly less health, I guess. Oh, those burns. Oh, the burns. Boo burns. What do I want to get back? Let me break. I need this over quickly. Some HP back. <sighs> 16 emotes because he was the first to reach Pirate Legend. What's Pirate Legend? Oh, Sea of Thieves. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Um. No heavy blade. I think it's all over. Had I used some dexterity potions, I would have at least survived this turn. Fuck. Alright. No more goofy shit. I can't even- I can't even attempt goofy shit at Ascension 3. I gotta be playing much smarter, much safer. Uh, no, 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 no. Random boss relic. Remove a card from my deck. Only had made it to the third. Okay, so merchant right away on those two, and then BBB question, question, question. Although this is also a lot of question marks. Then I can probably hit that into fire, that goes into fire. I can't go double fire here. Another fire, another fire. Guaranteed elite. I can just. Okay. Not gonna be a lot of fights over here. Well, I mean, all, literally all of those question marks can be fights, so who knows. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you, Notorious Crab. Okay, so go ape shit. I also only, like, rediscovered fast mode, like, last time I streamed, which is makes the cards load up and all the animations go way faster. Uh, hold up. 24 damage? I can't do that much. And I can't get through all his blocks, so... Okay. 
Fuck. 23. You can at least deal the one damage to him. Well, I'm not gonna get full health after this. Alright, now he's dead. Nope. What do we got? Mmm. Just gain the max HP. I love games that have fast mode. Limit Break is pretty legit as a win con. I mean, you really need, like, Heavy Blade. <sighs> Shit. Yeah, we'll stick with that. Transform a block. I've already gotten rid of a strike. Hey, Reaper's not bad. It's not, like, top tier, but it's not bad. Well, nothing I can do about that man in the back. So we'll just kill this guy off, I guess. Okay, five damage is fine. And there's the slime. May as well play it now. I don't think all question marks can be fights. I think it starts with a certain percentage and goes up for each consecutive question mark room that isn't a fight. Oh, really? Maybe. Uh, shit, this is 17 damage. Probably should've just used the Reaper. Eh, I'm making frail, whatever, I don't care. Dead. I like having a diversity of potions, so I have to skip that. This would've been really good last time when we had a lot of cards that give, gave vulnerable. Yeah, that would've been really good. Draw and gain- it basically- it's basically 5 free damage since it replaces itself, if they're vulnerable. Depends on bosses. This asshole. I think I just want Heavy Blade. Oh, you mean for a strength build. I was like- and then I came back here, I was like, there isn't even a fucking boomerang in here. Hold up, I'm gonna take off. Ugh. Sweatshirt. I'm getting a little rosy toasty now. My fucking headphone cable is underneath the wheel. It's going all fucking loose and fuzzy. Okay. Uh, don't need to rest at all. <sighs> Upgrading heavy blade is not great until I can gain strength. Upgrading reaper is not that great either. Although, on like the one fight where you are fighting four dudes and you gain like 20 fucking HP. Reaper's also good in strength build since you get to heal all that damage. Well, I heard that stat, maybe... Okay. Well, I know you watch other streams and stuff from people who know way more about what they're doing than I do, so I'll assume... I'll assume it's correct. So, upgrade to defend. Uh... I don't really need to Reaper, but... Mm -hmm. no. Just let it go. No strength. No strength. Against new Twitch TOS? Well, I'm still clothed. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Well, this is gonna suck. Uh, no free weakness from vulnerability. Rip. Hmm. Oh, wait, he's dead. Headbutt's pretty good. Especially for a strength build. You can get back. Limit break, you can back get back. Heavy strike. Does it really matter which one? Okay, so he's gonna lick me. As soon as he goes half health, he's gonna split into two. The two halves are going to have the same amount of HP. Okay. Wait, he's not gonna split yet? So I wanna save it and do as much damage as possible. No, that's 32, and he'll still be vulnerable next turn, so I wanna save it. So that's the ASMR girl. 
one less piece of clothing and they'd be in the nude. Okay. Um, I guess I do this. I do that. And turn. Yeah. Okay, well, they're both going to Slime Town. Uh, I can kill either one of them. Alright. This is a pretty easy fight. I haven't started turning my deck into garbage yet, that's probably why. I haven't found Ancient Potion to be super useful, in all honesty. I want none of these. Oh, ice cream! I, I'm always a fan of ice cream. Mmm, toolbox! I've had some pretty good, uh, pretty good experiences with toolbox. We don't need any naps. Once again, it's like, ugh. Upgrade the defend. Early health gain from Reaper will make bonfires more useful for smithing. Yeah, I guess that's true. This is a good fight for Reaper. Not that I really need it. Choose an attack from the draw pile and place it into your hands. Heavy blade would be good if I had a source of source of strength. I guess I have this, which is just like, yeah, whatever. Anyway, they're uh, they're doing a bunch of damage. I don't have anything to stop them. I can do 17. Nope. Mm. Well, I'm gonna need that Reaper <laughs> to heal up this fucking health. None of them are buffing. Oh wait, he uh, he only has 16 after his blocks. So yeah, I can kill him. Take seven, whatever. Not a big idea. No, not a not a big idea. Not a big problem. Okay, I'm not frail. I'm weak. What is that? Fifteen. So I do like this, this. Uh, yeah. Put the Reaper back since. Well, there's only two of them now. I want to use that Reaper pretty soon. Probably. Hold up. Seven. He'll actually still be alive, and he's doing eight damage. Yeah, fuck it. Each pot is good for Sneko and with Flex. Using it before Flex keeps the strength permanently. Right, 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 because it counts it as a debuff. I mean, I can just, like, kill this guy. Sure, I'll take a free headbutt, I guess. Oh, wait. He dies, doesn't he? Headbutt was a good idea! Nope. <clears throat> By one week to all enemies exhaust. Clash. No. We skipping. No. Or Chalcom's really good. We have a flex! We have no way to keep that strength, though. Not yet. Rip Ancient Potion. Or Chalcum's really good. Bottle of Flame's really good. First things first. Uh, yeah, we've gained three attacks, so yeah, let's pull Strike out. Do I gain that demon form? I think I kind of have to, instead of just hoping on Limit Break, because if we never get Limit Break... I, like, I need some source of, like, permanent strength. Ooh, excuse me, Jesus. I'm full of gas today, my apologies. Yeah. It's rough in how much it costs. We've got an energy potion, so... Okay. Uh, hey, Finesse. It's not bad. Gain two block, draw a card, cost nothing. Um, yeah, let's use this energy right now. It's demon form. And then double defend plus. I'll block most of the damage. Now we're getting two strength a turn. Now I want to upgrade that heavy blade. I think upgrading demon form makes it cost two, which is a lot more reasonable. It's a lot more flexible that way. Um, well, I have no... Nothing to block with. I should have. Uh, I don't know what I should have done. 
that defend back. I don't think I want a Reaper yet. Why didn't I just use Heavy Blade? I would have done more damage. I'm an idiot. Doi 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 doi. Yup. 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 Okay, still taking some damage. It's like. <laughs> now Reaper will heal us for 14. Deal 7 damage. We could kill this guy. Well, let's do this first. We could really kill that guy. But yeah, let's heal up, finish him off. And then this guy is just gonna like. He, he sometimes attacks, but he mostly just puts garbage in our hand. Which I'm fine with. Uh, oh. No, the deck recycled. I thought I still had Heavy Blade in there. Whatever, he's dead. Okay. Doing better so far. Nope. Heavy Blade. I don't think I. Sorry for that. For that bang, that was the that fly was on the the desk here, and I was trying to trying to get him really fast. Luckily, this is like the easiest turn one boss. Cost of cards in your hand to one this turn. I mean, it's free. Fuck it. It doesn't exhaust itself, so why not? Um. Yeah. Well, I, actually, I can just go ape shit on this guy. So. Sure, I might be able to use that next turn on Heavy Blade or something. Okay. Uh, oh, whoop. Mmm, yeah, use that on the demon form. Uh, so I take three damage each time he does a thing. But, well, each time I hit him. But he's also vulnerable, which means I want to hit him more. I don't want to use a weak potion here. Eh, I'll be fine. What's that, 16? I'm gonna lose 3 health for this, but... We heal, we fully heal after bosses, so... Like, we're fine. I have to do 40 damage? No. Easy. Fucking... Easy cheesy. And then we headbutt to put the heavy blade back on top of our... I keep saying library, like this is Magic the Gathering. Back on top of our deck. Hey, now it does 44 damage. That's really cool. Uh, eat shit. Also, headbutt, heavy blade, back on top. Oh, look at that, heavy blade. Rip. That's why I took headbutt, because I've, I've done this before. It's like, once you get limit break, if and when you get limit break, it's like, then you can decide, you can either put limit break back on top. It's like, once, once you hit, like, 7, 8 strength, it's just like... Yeah, just put limit break, because then you're just like, now I have 16 strength, now I have 32 strength, now I have 64 strength. Dead. Oh, that's a really good. I'd rather have battle trance, but that's really good. That's also pretty good, especially if we're gaining a shitload of strength. Continuous plus max HP means we heal more. Oh, I forgot I have ice cream. I haven't even been using it. Hmm, that means that energy. I don't even need to use that turn, necessarily. So, energy generation is much, much, much better for us because of the ice cream. Because of the ice cream. Mm. <clears throat> Feed is so good with the strength build, though, since the higher the damage, the more likely to kill the enemy with it. But no. I think... Especially since we got Reaper that gets buffed with the strength, I think I'm gonna forward the offering. One potion, gain 30 gold, raise your max HP, obtain a card, upgrade a random card. Yeah, no, I've, I've had bad luck. Sozu, I love Sozu. Can't get potions anymore. Gain an energy at the start of the turn. Yes, please. Offering is better than Trance. It depends on the type of deck you're running. It's like... I've got the extra energy here, and like, if I have one or two other sources of extra energy, it's like... Battle Trance, I think, is way better, because it doesn't exhaust itself. And it also doesn't cost the 4 HP. 
And it's like once we get demon form out of our out of our deck, it's like uh, so I can still remove a card at that merchant. I think I have to remove the, the regular block. And then picking up like another good block card, like shrug it off. I would like that to happen. Um. Yeah. So we remove. No, I think we still remove one more strike. Just because we've gotten three extra attacks. We've removed three attacks. we removed two defends, but got no extra block cards. So I think we still remove a strike. Um, so let's see, so I have to go here. And then it's a guaranteed elite there. This way is like a bunch of question marks. If I go this way, I can go left. Treasure, treasure. I mean, not treasure, fire. This way, guaranteed elite. Or this way, I can hit another fire. Then I don't get a merchant. I don't really desperately need to remove stuff. How many cards do I need to upgrade? I probably want to upgrade this. Hmm, maybe. Oh no, it's more strength per turn. Hmm. If I'm not gonna get limit break, then upgrading this is a priority. Heavy Blade's already upgraded. It's like Heavy Blade and like Defend is all I really need to upgrade. So I don't need fires that bad. Hold up, how many fires can I hit, Matt? It's like one, two, three, four. If I go this way, it's like one, two, three. But then I have to fight two elites for it. But I got a pretty good deck now. And Sozu. Where's that higher up merchant? There was another merchant up here, wasn't there? Right there. There's also one over here. What does this path look like? Uh, I gotta skip a lot of fires and fight a lot of elites. Two guaranteed elites. Three fires. I think... Is there any way I can hit two merchants? Yeah, but that's a rough path. I think I have to go with the path that gives me the most options. Hold up, what is this? Whenever you play a debuff to an enemy, they take three damage. That's not great, but sure. Do that before he puts his debuff on me. Uh, heavy blade no good. Bash, headbutt. I had an extra energy. Rip. Wait, where did this fifth energy? Oh yeah, ice cream! Ice cream! Thank you! Delicious. Oh, he just made me weak. He didn't do his, like, really big debuff. What a wiener. How about... Eat even more shit. It's like, if I had... Two energy. If I had the pyramid that let me keep my cards each turn as well, like they don't get discarded, then I'd do it. Uh, okay, well he's still not hitting me, so I'm going to hit him. Real big and bad. Yeah, I think he's toast. I think he's fucking toast. Die? Who would have thought ice cream was so OP? It's probably one of my favorite relics. I really like Sozu, too. Because, like, potions are kind of good, but, like, not as good as one energy per turn. Nowhere near as good as one energy per turn. I want none of... Bonus Sword Boomerang with gaining extra strength is, like, not as good as Heavy Blade, but it's still pretty good. Plus, it's more flexible in that it only costs one, and it's already upgraded, so I guess I'll... I only have one defend to upgrade, and I'd rather get rid of the strikes. Yeah. Especially since I just got a sword boomerang. Okay, this asshole. Uh, yeah. Do that. <laughs> um, what is he still doing? 10 damage? Okay. Yeah, 
Grab this again, because I think all this guy does is just whack. Okay, that's... What this does is, like, he gains this much block at the start of each turn, and this number only goes down every time I deal damage to his actual HP. So, like, having something that hits four times... I probably should have played that second, actually. But, whatever. So we're down two HP, doing this puts us down six, that's how much we heal. Um... Instead... Fine. Mmm, there's our demon form. Yep. Yeah. And we'll save the, uh, the energy for next turn. Thanks, ice cream. Hey, look at this. You're weak again. Eat shit. Uh, I can take one damage. I can heal the rest up with fucking... with Reaper. Save the two energy. Wait, did he heal when he hit me? Hold up. Um, okay, I got six energy, so we'll make him vulnerable. I don't want to accidentally kill him. What, what can I put back on top? I can put Heavy Blade back on top. Yeah. So do that first. Yeah, we're at full health. I have no block, I just realized. Oh, wait, he might be dead? Yeah, he's dead. Never mind, we win. Mm, nope, none of these. Yes, we go on left. To the left, to the left. Okay, okay, these assholes again, that's fine. Finesse, that's a fine card, I'll take it. Mm, don't need the Reaper right now. The only thing with Sword Boomerang is you don't get to pick the targets. Well, I definitely want to do this. Yeah, I still need some more block in this deck. Uh, yeah, put the Defend Plus back on top. Okay, this is gonna be a little rough. I should be fine. Uh, yeah, okay, so that's a guaranteed Demon form, so I'll take that because I get the extra energy. Heavy Blade doesn't do much for us right now. Defend Plus. Oh, shit, someone made me frail. Defend Plus. I can take the two. But I don't really need to. Since I'm getting stronger and stronger every turn, I can just wait. Although, she heals for like 16 every, you know. I can play the waiting game, it's fine. Mm. Yeah, it doesn't do much for me. That's not enough healing. Put Sword Boomerang back? I think you might be undervaluing AoE. One cleave would have been decent. Maybe. Maybe. I mean, here, it's actually not great since she heals both of them. You want to focus on one. Sword Boomerang's kind of like AoE. Hmm. He's not vulnerable. But I have Bash. Which means... He dead. I could kill you right now, or I could Reaper you for 12. Okay. In fact, yes, I'm guaranteed to get Reaper next turn, because the only way I don't get Reaper is if I draw all five of these and Finesse draws me a card. So, yeah, I'm gonna do that so I can get a little bit of extra health. So it'll take a little bit of damage here, but it's like... Oh, hey, look at that. Whoa! Can't gain it, the Sozu eats it. No, I only have one card that does that and exhausts it, so- Oh, if I could grab both of these. Oh no, that's for each attack you played. I've never had... No. I don't really like fire breathing. We go in... We go in left, though. Two elites back to back. Elite fight elite. I don't know that I like that. Not with how fucking hard they hit now. Okay, so... These are both assholes. He's the one who keeps getting stronger, although this guy can also buff himself. Hey! 
Hey, upgrade all of your cards for the rest of combat. That's a pretty that's a pretty good uh, neutral card to get. Cool. I gotta hit him three times to knock him down, otherwise he takes half damage. Uh, so this will do that. In that case, I'll start working on the man in the back. Ayo. Yeah, like, once he gives himself one strength, since he hits for six times, it's like, yikes. So this is whenever I play a non-attack, shuffle a dazed into my draw pile. Which is pretty fucking annoying. If I do say so. I can't- oh wait, I can hit him with three attacks and knock him down. But then I can't defend. Yeah, that's what the toolbox says. At the start of each combat, add a random colorless card to your hand. So colorless cards, well you can't see it because it's exhausted. Uh, but like my finesse- oh wait, right. The finesse that I had last turn was also from toolbox. I don't have any colorless- colorless cards, there are a few of them. They're all really good. Uh, they usually cost zero, and they're actually- you can get them as either class. They're neutral. But there's only like ten of them. Um, and you don't get offered them, um, when you finish a combat, like the three cards. You can buy them from merchants. Merchants, like the bottom two, the bottom left two cards are the two neutral cards that the merchant will sell, and the rest will be your own class cards. Um, that and the toolbox. And there are a couple of events. Boss is champion? I thought champion was like the toughest. Was considered the toughest. Although, with our strength builds, like, yeah, we should be fine. But, um, what am I doing? Do I want to knock this man down? That prevents 6 damage. Or this prevents 8 damage? Yeah. I think I have to do this. And then, Heavy Blade is like, whatever. I get more damage out of the double strike and just save the mana with the ice cream. Save it for the ice cream. There we go. I could really use a demon for. Right about meow. You know what? I will actually use this offering. There we go. Give me the demon form. Heavy Blade doesn't do anything yet. Sword Boomerang is not... I mean, if all three hit him, that would be pretty good, but... Can't, can't rely on that. 18 damage, huh? That's, uh, pretty rough. Pretty fucking rough. Put the defend plus back on top, I guess. <sighs> Maybe I should have saved some of that mana. Holy fuck. Really? Well... This sucks. Well, it actually does half damage to him, so it's only 12 healing. Well, 16 plus 12, it's still a net positive. And it deals some damage to this asshole. Those dazes in my fucking deck are annoying as shit. Please knock that man out of the air. Nope. Killed that man, though. Man, if you leave these birds in the air, they, they get fucking nasty. Hold up. Get out of here. Go to hell. It's still gonna hurt. And even though that guy's gone, like, I still keep the debuff, so it's like, fuck. Hey! Hey, buddy! I got a present for ya. Collector would be the worst against this deck. What is Collector? Automaton is second worst. Champion is best. Strength and Heavy Blade can wreck him. I'm not sure I've ever faced the Collector. Uh, I want none of these. If I gave more energy, I'd really want to upgrade it. Upgrading demon form is pretty important. Upgrading that other block is pretty important. I think I want to go up the left side. 
two elites is kind of rough, but I can use most of the fireplaces at this point for napping, because there's not much that's really worth upgrading. And I want to hit that shop. <sighs> but it's all fights. It's a, like, fire, one treasure chest, a shop, and then fight, fight, fight. <sighs> Or is this like question fire? I can choose here, then it's like question question. Dude with flame heads. Not like the six flames. Oh, you mean the, the dude on the skull who summons the guys. Gotcha. I got twenty-five, I don't need that much. I only need twenty-one. Uh <sighs> Upgrade the last defend. Better safe than sorry. I think we're gonna chicken out and pull right. Heal 28 HP here, I can probably forego that fire and fight an elite instead. And then I should be fine on that fire. What's better, choosing one of 20 cards or gaining a random ass relic? Well, I guess it depends on what the relic is. I've already got some pretty solid relics here. And I can't skip the. Ooh, a second heavy blade. Second heavy blade. Shrug it off's not bad either. You know what's better than a second heavy blade? Double tap. It's like a second heavy blade, but one mana cheaper. Admittedly, it's only when you also have heavy blade in hand, but all right. Yeah, that was uh, that was pretty good. Do I want to upgrade double tap? So like if I play it on a turn where I use offering or where I've saved up a bunch of mana, then I can like I can like heavy blade, heavy blade, reaper, reaper with an upgraded double tap. But I think before that, I need to upgrade demon form. Just cause no other source of strength gain. It really goes fucking wild with Oh hey, happy flower! Which works really well with ice cream. Every three turns gain an energy. I'm liking. I'm liking this. Okay, so we still have... Add one random colorless card to your hand is the random colorless card we got from Toolbox. Hey! Most of my deck's already upgraded, but... I'm not sure I even want to play this this turn. One, two, three, four, five, seven... <laughs> Heavy Blade's no good right now. He's just... Actually, yeah, I don't have much to spend mana on anyway. Sure, Apotheosis. Or, well, I could have saved it. I could have saved the mana. Yeah. Whatever. It's fine. Now everything costs a random amount. That's what this confused status that he does. Heavy hitting, major mana gain. I like this build. It seems? It seems pretty good. Oh, yeah. Demon form for one mana? I'll take it. Uh, I think I need to block here. There's a- one of the relics is the Sneko Eye, which is like that weird eye they have. You're always confused, but you draw- what is it? Two extra cards per turn? Okay. Three cost offering. Pretty bad. Pretty bad. Zero cost defend, though. It's like, fuck. I just need to kill this man. I think I'd rather just save the three mana. Eating a lot of shit here. Hey, Heavy Blade. Oh, he's dead anyway. Uh, may as well Reaper then, right? May as well double tap Reaper. Get some health back. Gimme, gimme. All that health. All the health. And then we heal. Yeah, we're like, okay, that fight was going like pretty rough. And then we got it. We got double tap into fucking Reaper with the extra strength. Needs it. Mm. Do I really need to upgrade double tap? 
Upgrade defend. Oh, they're all upgraded, actually. Yeah, healing for 11 twice is pretty good. And then healing for 6 at the end. Yeah, yeah, 28 HP back. That's already upgraded. Offering is not that super. Although it could be if I play it on a turn where I already have a shitload of energy from ice cream. Headbutt is just like an extra 3 damage. Reaper is just an extra 1 damage. So the only thing... The only thing to really upgrade is double tap and maybe offering. I think I'd rather fight the elite. Oh man, that every three turns is across is across battles too. Okay, these assholes, that's fine. Uh well, I can't keep the card. These guys have so little fucking health too. Jesus. At times like this I wish I'd upgraded that double tap. <laughs> wow, then I wouldn't be in this fight, would I? The guy does 10 damage, and I don't like that. So I would kind of like him to be dead. One, two, three... Where do I apply the fourth? I guess I don't. Maybe if I weaken him, and kill him instead? And that's like... One, two, three, four... Yeah... No. One, two, three, four. That'll kill him. And then we blind that boy. Yeah! I figured it out. I figured it out. No damage. Get him, boy. Wow, plus four strength? Holy fuck. That's how he got to eight strength that one time. I thought he was gaining two strength a turn, or every time he buffed himself, when in fact he was gaining four. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I think we're just offering right now. Get demon form going. 40 fucking damage. I have to kill him. I have to. He's got 16 health. Shit. Hold up. Let's see where this goes first. Okay. Headbutt him. Um... I think I want this blind. I think I want to hit him with that, maybe. And then... Wow! 30 damage! Wait, this is an elite fight, right? Okay, fine. I accept. Uh, I don't want a reaper right yet. Uh, I guess I'll just blind him. Headbutt, grab the blind back. Save the reaper for when he makes the dudes. You know what, let's just, let's just keep you really, really weak. I like the prospect of that. Fuck, that's a lot of damage. Hold up. He's not vulnerable. I just played double tap, right? What is that, four? It's 20 extra damage. It's 40 extra damage. Ah. Well, I'm after wrong. It doesn't matter. Get the fuck out of here. Ah. What were we at? 82 at the start? Took 12 damage. Hey! Two additional cards. Oh, we don't have additional energy at the start of her. I thought we did. I think we're actually pretty good on the card draw. I think we're actually pretty good. Alright, that was like, whatever. Swift Strike. Zero cost, deal five damage. Meh. 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 And Reaper only heals me for the unblocked damage. This guy's an asshole. This guy's an asshole. He keeps putting crap in my deck. Um... Nobody's attacking. One, two, three, four, five. I could spend all my mana, or I could save it for next turn. Double tap. 
Hold up. Oh, that doesn't act. Oh, wait. And then Swift Strike. Okay. And he is a thing, he does not lose block at end of turn, so I'll save that extra energy. Fucking run after. Yeah, yeah, if they've got that little skull symbol, that means they're minions. Uh, Demon the Form. I need to use an offering here. Because I need some blockage. Not a lot of blockage. Yeah, I either need more card draw or uh, maybe I should have grabbed the uh, the brutality or whatever it's called. Or I need one more decent card for blocking with. Because I think I'm just a little shy. Uh, and then we bash. And then we swift strike. Yeah, he's got artifacts which prevent debuffs, so he didn't take the vulnerable from my bash. Uh, I could have headbutted. What would I? No, there's nothing in there that I really want. Ayo. Mm, frail. Magical. What is that? 50 something? Shit. Yep. Just shy. Being able to kill him. And now I have to take a shitload of damage. Don't think Brutality is actually very good. If if you've got the synergy for it, if you've got like the red skull and the one that gives you extra energy when you're under 50% health, and you have like bites or something, so you like can keep like going up and down and up and down and like staying under 50% without actually being in danger because of all the healing and shit. Then I think there it can really shine, but it's like, yeah, in most situations I don't think it's that great. Did I ask for a second heavy blade? I may have asked for a second heavy blade. I think I'm gonna take a second heavy blade. Hmm, not great. Well, they're not attacking. So I can just get away with a demon form, and then pass, and save the mana. Yeah, I'll do that. <sighs> God, 15 extra damage. They're still not attacking. Okay, well, here, I have a present for you. It's called... Oh, that's both of them. It's called Heavy Blade into Headbutt into Heavy Blade. She's probably going to heal them. I probably didn't need to use that strike. And then he's going to go... Ooh! Oi! I mean, the double tap could kill her, but he's the one hitting me, so... Uh, it might not even be worth losing the 4 HP here. Um... Yeah, you know what? I'll just wait until the turn where she doesn't have block. Oh yeah, right. For some reason I was thinking it only the artifact only lasted a turn. Oh hey, the pie has it going. Yeah, yeah, for some reason I was thinking it only lasted the turn. Like I had to use it on a turn where they were debuffing me. And look, now she's debuffing me. Uh are you dead? You're dead. You're really dead. A little tired, a little hoarse, but other than that, not too bad. Hmm. Upgraded Rage was not really the block card I was looking for. Once Demon Form Reaper and Offering get out, it's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven attacks to three blocks. It is an upgraded rage. And it costs nothing. Sure, we might not get anything more worthwhile. <sighs> and we lose nine strength for the rest of this turn. Hmm. Yikes. Rage is no good here. I don't want an offering just to try and get the uh good Reaper. Disconnects, that's a bummer. I could pass, save all this mana, because like all my attacks are better the longer I wait because of demon form. 
Yeah. I'm just gonna fucking pass. What you gonna do? Oh, right. Well, I guess it's a good thing I passed. Because God knows how much shit costs now. Mm, no demon form. Just looking forward to that demon form. Yikes. Yikes of palooza. Keeping him super vulnerable is probably better. I'm gonna do this. And pass. Yeah, I might need to sleep. Yeah, get the demon form rolling. Uh, no heavy blade. Fuck. Kinda need to do the heavy defend. Sure. Fucking... Three cost double tap, three cost back. Save the mana. At least I'm not taking damage this turn, and he's still vulnerable next turn, so... Healing 10. Oh god. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I think... I kill him? Oh, healing 15. Right, because of vulnerable. I think I just kill him now. Okay. Nope. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. What do I still need to upgrade? I think I can take him with 60 health. I need to upgrade that other heavy blade. Yeah. Oh, whoops, I didn't actually hit Smith. I was looking, just looking at the deck regularly. Yeah, upgrade that other heavy blade. Yeah, I can probably take this guy with 60 HP, no problem. Bosses don't hit harder yet. Okay, finesse. I'll take it. Um. I think I just want to wait until I have. Uh. Demon form. That's the one. Actually, use the defend. Let's double tap Reaper right now. No. I, think I want to double tap Badge. Let's save the mana. I'd rather wait till I have more strength. Ow! That fucking hurt. Um. Okay. Yeah. Uh, now's a good time. Ooh, especially since I'm weaker. Or frailer, I should say. Frailer and vulnerable. Blue is great with flash, steel, or clash sometimes. Oh yeah, I can see that. I can see that. Uh, one block, sure. Uh, okay, he's debuffing, so I can kind of go a fuck. Spend all the mana. Spend all the mana. Put the heavy blade back. You know what? I'm gonna be safe. I'm gonna save the mana. <sighs> what do you say? Something, something, hotshot, feeling weak, something, something. I don't care. I don't care. Your words are, are bullshit. Hey. What I got? How'd that feel, buddy? Save it. Are you buffing again? Jesus. Um... 12 is probably... Since I full heal at the end of this fight, 12 will be fine. Uh, well... I'm pretty sure... Yeah. And he's dead! Not great with trying new things. Uh... They haven't gone super well. Well, no, my... Like, the first time I tried a block build, that was a new thing, and it went pretty fucking well. He was... Involve this card. Uh, I want none of these. Yeah, none. <laughs> Potions always drop after fights. Rip. Hmm. 
15 cards, 6 HP, every time I enter a rest site. I have no other options at rest sites other than sleeping and buffing. How many cards have I been playing turn on the turn on average? It's like one, especially when I have a shitload of mana stored up. 100% feather? Are you sure? But the turns, the turns, the turns could be mad, mad I say, mad. Five HP a turn. It does. I get so much energy on some turns. And even then, I'm usually playing like heavy blades and like other more expensive shit. <sighs> but heavy choker's so good. It's so good. It's so good. Eternal Feather's alright. I've played with it before. Better safe than sorry. We are going into Act 3, I guess. You guys are probably right. That's the guy with the powers, right? How many powers do I have? One? One. Alright, that's fine. Oh, it stacks. Oh, it stacks. No, I, I know that one. Oh yeah, no, I've had, I've had runs where it's like I... Every turn I have like six energy and shit like that. And then you have ice cream, it's just like, I can't even spend all my fucking energy so I get extra. We haven't hit a merchant in a while, and I got a lot of money. And we can make a choice. Wow, go to Question Alley. Hold up. Question Alley, double fire. That's double fire there. And then I have to fight an elite. I have to fight an elite going this way. Third fire on that side. I have to go elite, fire, elite. I don't need fires that bad. I probably need a merchant more than I need a fire. There's no way for me to get over on this side, so there's still only one merchant. Double tap bludgeon. Which one's bludgeon? Wait, is that the... No, that's bash. Oh, is, is bludgeon the one that gets stronger every time you play it? Because, hold up, there's no... Yeah, there's no late... Merchant here, so I can wait on the merchant, so I can get all these juicy question marks, and then like bang, bang, bang. Even more, qu yeah, I can skip a ton of fights. Fuck it. Hey guys, how's it going? A skill for my draw pile. Double taps a skill. Not that I really want it here. What I want is demon form. Gimme, gimme. Well, fuck. Oh, yeah, that one, that one, that one. Yeah, yeah, I've played with that one. Um, how much damage am I taking here? None. I think I just... Pass. See? How many cards did I play that turn? Like, two, three? How many cards am I gonna play this turn? Oh, fuck, that's a lot of damage. I don't have the block for that shit. God, Battle Trance, where are you when I need you? It's like, what, one, two... Fuck. Barricade Body Slam. This is gonna suck real bad. It's like, because my only source of card draw eats itself. Yeah. So most turns I literally can't play more than five cards. I actually, well, six there. But that's that's a random, random bullshit. Yeah. Yeah. I should have got the fucking choker. I mean, if I get a battle trance, then, mm, but still. I've... I think I've done- I think I've done two fully successful runs with Choker and Battle Trance. And zero unsuccessful ones, because... Have I ever done an unsuccessful Velvet Choker run? I'm not sure I have. Anyway... We need to block. Hmm. 
How much damage is that? It's enough to kill somebody? I think it's enough to kill somebody. My brain is just having a complete fucking- yeah, that's 58 damage. So what I'm gonna do first is heal up all the bullshit. Wait, was- were some of these guys blocking? I don't know. And then just fucking kill a bitch. See you later. Yeah, and that was like, what, four cards? Five cards? I should've taken the Joker! Well, then again, we are- we're also getting beat up pretty bad here. A buff? Don't, aren't you supposed to be question mark, question mark, question mark for reforming? I thought that's how that worked. Uh, I think we have to rage here. Well, I'm playing three attacks either way, so... Can we put that heavy blade back on top? Yeah, thank you. Uh, I guess I'll save it, because I don't want him to die. Well, I get heavy blade. You know what? Yeah, I can probably... And plus, I wanted the extra block. Oh, okay, so never mind. They change the question mark when they're hit, and then. Hey, that's not cool. Hey, that's kind of cool. Uh, hold up. 12 times. Yeah, okay. And then just for funsies, we double tap the sword boomerang. No, I need a good block card, and it's been put in front of me, because rage is still not white enough. Nope, stop. So, we'll take Shrug it off. And then we'll go to the right. Hmm. A fight. Sure. Yeah. Why not? I only gain 5 block if I do that. I gain 8 block if I do this. And I'm already 8, eight block. And he's doing 16 damage. Blah, 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 blah. Whatever, rage doesn't cost any, uh... Hey. hey. I need to block things. Not super great. I think I need to get this man as low as possible, as fast as possible. I think he's dead next turn. I think I just killed him. Ow, my bones. Yeah, he's dead. No Reaper, though. Bummer. No Fire Potion, though. Double bump. Bubble Strike! There's the- I, I said- I've been saying, like, I need some fucking card draw. There's some fucking card draw. Oh, wait, shit. Man, this is actually kinda good. Especially once you upgrade it, and then it costs zero. I lose the HP. We've got the feather now, so I think I can actually afford this. I have to fight at least one elite, though. Oh, yeah. I didn't even think about Iron Wave. Right. But, no, I wanted something that was, like, a, a better block than Iron Wave. Not, like, block plus attack, that's fine, whatever. Um... Fucking madness. See, the problem with Madness is, like, if it hits a card I don't want to play this turn, then I... I'm minus on mana this turn and plus on mana on a later turn, but if you can, like, manipulate it so that, like, the only things in it are two costs, then... And especially once you upgrade it to cost zero, then it's pretty good. Uh, I think I shrug it off. Wow. Draw four cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Minus two, which means six. Sure. Okay, well, got more defense. I don't want to, like, headbutt, shrug it off back up top. Oh god. I'm in trouble. I'm in some trouble. Okay. Shrug it off. Rage, why are you all still attacking me? 
make this defend cost zero. Uh, shit. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. God damn it. I didn't get fucking demon mode going. Um, yeah, I need. I just need to use this. Make the other defend free. I don't think I can afford to lose 4 HP here. <sighs> Fucking ouch. Stop! Stop! If I double tap Heavy Blade, that makes Demon Form cost one. Although that's only for the one time I cast it. Whereas if I... Hold up. Rage. We demon form. Shit. We pray to Orange Jesus. I don't need AOE. I need them to not all hit me so hard at the. Well, I just fucking. I think we. I think. I, think I just lost the run. Fuck, that was so good, too. That was so good. Yeah, we need a demon form earlier. Like, the biggest thing is demon form being our only source of strength. Not having limit break was a weakness, because, like, the last two strength builds I did both had limit break. The madness is kind of... Well, it's past two, and the run is done. I still have yet to get past Ascension 3. Anyway, you all, you all know when I stream, like always, you can follow links down below. I think this Sunday and Monday is when I'm going to start doing the midday streams, so that would be 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. my time. For reference, it's 2.15 a.m. my time. So... Figure that out. And yeah, we're gonna be doing Dark Souls on that. I've compiled like a list of other games that I wanna play eventually. Um, not necessarily in order, but I wanna do like the Metal Gear Solid series, stuff like Hollow Knight, Salt and Sanctuary, Axiom Verge, Mega Man Legends. Uh, Resident Evil 4 is pretty high up on one uh, that I wanna do relatively soonish. I'd like to do both a regular run and a professional mode run. And maybe a run with the Chicago typewriter, because that's just kind of fun. But anyway, we'll get there when we get there. You guys have a good night.